Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make the viral TikTok strawberry crunch cookie. So let's get started with the video. We're going to begin by making the strawberry crunch topping. In a food processor, add 24 golden Oreos. Then blend the Oreos until they become crumbs. When you're finished, pour the Oreo crumbs in a bowl. Then add 3 ounces of strawberry jello powder and 4 tablespoons of melted butter. Next, mix everything together until well combined. When you finish mixing everything together, it should look like this. Once you finish making the strawberry crunch topping, set it to the side. Now we're going to make the cream cheese frosting. In a bowl, add 8 ounces of room temperature cream cheese and a half a cup of room temperature unsalted butter. Then beat the cream cheese and butter together until smooth. Make sure to scrape the sides when you're finished. Next, add one teaspoon of vanilla extract and then gradually add three cups of powdered sugar. Continue to beat the frosting until the sugar is well combined and the frosting is light and fluffy. Once you're finished making the frosting, place it in the fridge until you're ready to use it. Now we're going to make the cookies. In a bowl, add one box of strawberry cake mix. Then add two eggs. And one third cup of vegetable oil. Then mix everything together until well combined. Once you finish making the cookie dough, use an ice cream scooper to scoop out the dough and place it on a baking sheet lined with parchment paper. Then, bake the cookies in the oven at 350 degrees for 10 to 11 minutes. Once the cookies have finished baking in the oven, place them on a wire rack to cool completely. Once they have cooled completely, pipe the cream cheese frosting on top of the cookies. Then sprinkle the strawberry crunch topping on each cookie. Finally, add some sliced strawberries on top of each cookie.
And that's it, you are all finished making the strawberry crunch cookies. And here's the finished result. These cookies were so good, they look amazing, and they were easy to make. They also look like the cookies from Crumble Cookie, which is super cool. Alright, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Everything I used in this video will be down in the description below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!